Welcome back. A rescue mission in Middle Tennessee is now over tonight. A diver who had become trapped in a cave is now safe. Josh Bratchley had been missing for more than 24 hours. He's a member of that British diving team that rescued a Thai boy soccer team from a cave last year. Well, that cave is located in Jackson County, the one where he was trapped. It took specially trained divers around an hour to carry out the rescue. ABC's Romina Puga now has more on what happened tonight, including the conditions Bratchley found himself in. Rescue efforts underway in Tennessee for the diver trapped in an underground cave. He went missing around 3 p.m. Tuesday. His fellow divers spent hours trying to locate him before calling authorities. They had to dive and back under that tree is the opening of the cave and it's a very narrow opening. Dispatchers received a call around 1.15 a.m. from the group saying one of their members had not returned from a cave dive. There was a group of about five that went in to explore this cave. When they came back out, they were missing this one individual. ABC News has learned that the diver could be Josh Bratchley, a member of an elite team that helped rescue the 12 soccer players and their coach from the cave in Thailand last summer. Officials say this dive is far shorter than the one in Thailand, longer than a football field, but has passages just three feet wide. And the water is cold, only 55 degrees. The gentleman in the cave is wearing a dry suit, um, so that gives him a, a great chance um, that he's, he's just sitting in there waiting uh, for us to come in and, and to, to get him. That's our hope. An air pocket like that could buy the diver precious time. We do know that there's sufficient air in that bell to survive for an extended period of time uh, greater than 24 hours. Not many divers have the experience to pull off a rescue like this, so they've called in experts from across the country. Their biggest concerns are lack of air and hypothermia. Romina Puga, ABC News, Los Angeles.